Center fielder DJ Artis is no stranger to the MLB draft being picked in the 40th round out of high school. He was hoping to hear his name called a little bit earlier this time. It was different this time because I, I had done a lot more. You know, in high school, you know, it was like four or five scouts that show up and uh, see me play. And this time it felt like every scout had seen me play. And I, I felt like I had made a name for myself in college. So I definitely felt like I had a, a better chance of going high. And um, I, it worked. So college worked out for me. The North Carolina native was more than relieved when he heard he was picked in the seventh round by the Chicago Cubs. It was a couple hours with my family and my friends, so it was very stressful. But when it finally happened, it was all worth it. It's a, it's a historic franchise, you know, they can develop talent, and I, I just can't wait to get started. You know, all the fan base, I've gotten a ton of followers already. Phone's been blowing up since it's happened still. I woke up this morning, all these texts, and it's just still so real. After having two standout seasons with the Flames, Artis completes his resume with numerous accolades, including several All-American honors and being nationally recognized as one of the most dynamic leadoff hitters in college baseball. But he also had two pitchers drafted on Wednesday night, Jack DeGroat going in the 11th round to the Cleveland Indians and Jackson Birch taking the 29th round by the New York Yankees. And no surprise to hear, Liberty's catcher Trey Todd was also taken in the draft picked in the 21st round by the L.A. Dodgers. But instead of finding out their traditional way, it would be his girlfriend who would break the news. I was uh, um, just playing NHL, actually, when I found out. Um, Mary was actually the one who told me. I was like, what are you talking about? And she was like, you got drafted. And I was like, really? Like, by who? <laughs> and then as like all that's going on, my phone just starts buzzing in my ears. For players to have their name called on draft night is a dream come true. Years of hard work finally pays off, thanks in part to the guidance and coaching they received during their time at Liberty University. Like Coach Jackson, he does a great job of like helping us. He cares more about how we are as men than how we are as baseball players. And um, I think that that's helped me mature a lot and like to realize the big picture. I mean, Liberty's helped me a lot. I've matured a lot, you know, going to school and uh, definitely a lot of work in the weight room and just helped me as a person at that school and all the friends and the, co the coaches and everything. It's just, uh, it's helped me out a lot. I would not be the ball player I am today, so.